this is the energy vibration reading for all the Taurus Sun Moon and Rising and um, for the month of October 2017 I want to say um, thanks to everyone thanks for returning thanks for this wonderful um, possibilities and energies um, it is going to be a month of the ending of a negative energies whatever negative situation that you Taurus had to deal with it's going to be a month of the ending of all the crosses and negative energies that you Taurus had to deal with for a time okay so whatever the situation is uh, that you are going to be going through and working through in this um, month it's going to be wonderful okay you Tauruses this is the month of um, justice and justice is the energy vibration of wonderful positive things that are coming in our lives it is going to be wonderful it's going to be a positive time in our lives okay as justice come that mean a balance is coming in your life the zodiac energy is going to be the energy of hair and water at the next two weeks it's going to be four weeks in this month I want to say please remember to listen to your um, Sun moon and rising sign on that this is very very important for you to do it I'm not sure if I'm going to do the general readings but I'll see how that comes out because it is such a busy time right now okay let's look you have gotten the ace of water so this is going to be good for you Tauruses this is going to be good the ace of water is the ace of cups so we are going to have love coming in our lives it's going to be wonderful it's going to be a positive positive energies for a lot of you Tauruses out there it's going to be a very very positive okay new love it's a month of new love it's a month of love that is coming in whatever negative situation that there was there has come and ending to it which is wonderful and which is beautiful because um, as we see this that mean um, whatever um, karmatic situation you have been dealing with is now ending as I said we have four weeks um, in these weeks we have uh, the energy vibration of fire the two first week um, hair the two first weeks and the two last week we have uh, some situation here going on in the first week we have the energy vibration of the Emperor energy vibration of the Emperor is saying that um there is going to be situation with work situation and um, it's all about work and it's all about business um, for some people it's going to be a situation with your father or a father figure or somebody in authority whatever the situation is you are going to win this situation and you're going to come out on top here we are with the energy of the ace of swords whatever you did you use the energy of the ace of swords to bring forth the justice for yourself so let's say that something injustice has happened to you in an authority situation for some people it's going to happen to you at work or has happened or is about to happen because it's going to happen in the first week which is next week and whatever the situation is you have the intellectual ability to use the ace of swords in a very positive way please do that because it's going to be a wonderful thing you're going to win whatever it is against someone who have done you injustice whether it is for some people at work it is for some people in a business that endeavor and it is for some people in an authority section where you have to deal with other people good news will be coming to you wonderful positive good news will be coming to you and this is a very very positive so the first week is a wonderful week for you Taurus it doesn't really matter who it is it can be good news from a friend good news 
um, if people have been waiting for um, green cards um, work permits um, uh, situation from authority government um, situation it's going to happen for you Tauruses in the first week as we look at the second week another wonderful fire energy and this is the ten of ones it is the end of negative things negative energies this reminds you of the energy of this bringing endings to negative things I love this car deck and I choose this card deck to work with in this week because this card deck is a wonderful deck because um, it brings forth wonderful energies and since I've started using three cards and two cards everybody is using it on YouTube but I guess somebody has to begin something but anyway um, this why I did this is because the angels and guides have asked me because the intergalactic and beams and the soul beams are here so they give extra information so here we are it's a burning away a releasing the excess endings clearing ways for a new beginning you may be overwhelmed and have taken and too many burden in this moment I do the work of decluttering your life all that you release will now take form and serve the greater all but I know not but you'll no longer need to hold on to it simply because it's one scene to have values for you thank it for what it has done for you but say goodbye to the emotions the relationships and situation that you realize do not belong in your life anymore this is wonderful and I'm smiling because something happened that I am saying also good <laughs> goodbye to okay the two of um, coins the two of Pentacle comes up and this is going to be wonderful because whatever the situation is and I am getting the, the energy um, the beams angels and guides are seeing the energy of people who are trying to leave a situation behind there are some people who are thinking of leaving relationships behind divorcing some people are thinking of leaving a place behind uh, some people are thinking about them going on their own um, leaving family going on their own starting over with their own family and uh, here is the situation of a house this can also be for some people who have found work work is going to come in for a lot of people in the second week whatever is happening in the universe is as if opening a portal for all the Tauruses in the second week work will be coming in for you guys in the second week and it's going to be good okay but foremost what I'm receiving is that the energy vibration of um, people who are looking for a new residency new place to live it's going to happen in the second week if you're looking to um, to begin courses you will find the right places and you will also have the money to do whatever you're looking for whatever study that some of you are looking for and whoever is has decided to move on move on ask the universe to provide the way so that you will have a new accommodation in your life okay this is going to be extremely good a two for a week is extremely good for you Tauruses so it's all about um, moving away transformation um, going on a new journey clearing the ways finding new places and new things in your life this is extremely good I am having I've <laughs> been doing so much of these readings so I have to be sipping <laughs> something from my throat okay a second reading third week we have the message of air somehow the message of air has been coming up this is one of the most positive positive energies that are happening 
whenever the message over here comes up there is a significant information that is going to come in for you Tauruses because the message of here has been coming up in this monthly readings for also other signs which is having a significance because whenever the energy of message comes up is that the universe has something it wants to let you know your spirit guides and it says opinions information by experience adherency to the Dogon alignment to the way of thinking or acting a learning response subconsciously programming and shift of consciousness react or respond you need not to burden your perception you need not to reach out to situation that no longer serve you I really want to say to each and every person if you find yourself moving away from things in your life and going on a new journey take that new journey even when you are not aware where this new journey is going where it will end go on this journey because there is a reason why you should whatever is happening leave this um, negative energy of people trying to um, uh, use you this is the energy of people using you this is the energy of people sucking your energy this is an energy of people who are vibrating at a lower energy vibration it's as if they're covering you up you know there are people sometimes you have these people in your lives that they come around and it's as if they take from you and you're thinking oh my god I didn't saw that one coming it's as if they're around you and you tend to spend more and give out more for some reason these are people who really sucks on you and they use manipulation to get things in your life move away from these people release yourself from these people and this is what the message of the universe is saying leave the situation behind whatever situation you feel as if you're been drained from people or you know in uh, perching on your energy release yourself and move away there are also people who um, sometimes uh, friend you for um, their personal um, because it's not as if they want to be friends with you they want they know that you are capable of certain things and they want to friend you for a reason but it's not for the right reasons and that is what it's saying in the third week go on a new journey move away these are rats rats eat on your stuff they crawl on you they suck on you remove yourself from that energy as we move on we also have the energy of the nine of water this is a positive energy this is the last week for you guys and it's a positive week and I'm going to show you why this whatever you were thinking about whatever you were trying to manifest if you were trying to manifest a new apartment you were trying to manifest new changes in your life whatever it is that you are trying to manifest in a positive way in your life it is going to happen for you okay dreams come true wishes fulfill uh, completion enjoyment contemplation and achievement of your desires this is a positive week because we have the page of cups coming in new love is coming in new people are about to connect with you in the last and final week of the month of October it's going to be special for a lot of people who were wishing for a positive and a dreamy relationship on wonderful things new love is coming in this is with friendship um, positive friendship positive people people who are going to 
um, receive you as who you are and accept who you are this is going to be a good and positive positive situation that is going to happen in your life and what else is going to happen money is going to come in your life as if by magic a lot of money so if you were trying to uh, manifest money to buy a car it's going to happen money to find a new place it's going to happen money to um, go back to school it's going to happen whatever you wanted a good job a well-paid job it's going to happen so for you Tauruses it's going to be wonderful I have not seen this card come up for another sign since I'm reading this is going to be a positive month for you Tauruses okay so as I look at your month um, it's it's a month of changes a lot of changes good news are coming in for you Tauruses whatever is happening with a house situation, if you are planning on moving, if you are planning on changing your life, if you are planning on leaving a relationship and you had to move out of the house, uh, ask the universe, it's going to happen in the second week. Third week is that there are people that you need to move away from, and I'm seeing a lot of relationships, people are uh, leaving their relationships behind and they're moving on to a better situation in their life, and this is going to be positive. And the last and final week is uh, the energy of the nine. Your wishes and dreams are coming true. So if you are wishing for an apartment, it's going to happen. New love, new people, new positive people are going to be entering your life and coming in your life. Please do not have any regrets of leaving people behind. Sometimes we think that people are with us because they really care about us, but they're only with us for whatever materialistic or uh, or whatever achievement or movement or um, what they can achieve by being with us but not in a positive way okay so whatever the negative things whatever that was happening it is finally coming to an end and you need to understand that life is about to change for all of you Tauruses but in a good way the third week is a little week that you're going to feel as if oh my god do I yeah why does this have to happen sometimes you need to leave the people behind because sometimes they're holding you back and you're not aware of it sometimes we try to go down to other people level always make sure that whoever you're invited in your life is that they are on the same um, part they're on the same level as you and if you have to go down to meet people it's uh, not one of the best uh, Thing to do because you can never um, be balanced out with them because if you are here and someone is here and you have to go down is that you're bringing yourself down to make that person feel comfortable if they truly wants to be with you they need to bring themselves up and if they can't bring themselves up that mean it was not meant to be I am sorry but that is what is happening money is going to come to you Tauruses in um, the last week it's going to be very positive it's as if money that you weren't expecting is going to come in for you Tauruses in the last week let's go forward and we are going to um, look at the love what's happening in the lives of the Tauruses for love I'm sorry but I have been doing so much readings on my throat so asking the angels and guys what is here for the Tauruses I love arena okay all right what is happening for you Tauruses in the love arena is you're protecting yourself you're protecting your heart you're protecting yourself from something it's as if you want to hope in your heart and really show love but some of you are holding it back and some of you are going to go through separations some of you Tauruses women are holding back you're not opening up to love you are watching looking at the situation 
and you're not opening up to love some of you men are walking away or want to run away it's as if you don't think that is the right person you're consciously not awakened for that person and some of you are moving um, want to move away the people who are in um, long-term relationships are going to stay in those relationships and they're going to be uh, yield and the people who are married um, some of you are going to be thinking about separating for whatever reason and uh, some of you are going to think um, let me see how this is going to work out and you're going to make changes by your next birthdays for some of you so it plays out for different people in uh, your life uh, business is going to be um, very good for the business people whoever is in business is going to be um, very very positive um, as we move on we're going to look at the zodiac energies because remember it is the monthly readings and I wish wish so much that I could give more extra long reading because I find them to be very important for a lot of people a lot of people want um, more in-depth and I wish I could but the last time there is so much um, so much my energy is um, given out to so much things okay let's look at the Sun moon and rising sign to see what is happening Sun, moon, and rising sign. What is that then for the sun? Moon and rising sign. What is that then for the sun, moon, and rising sign? Okay, let's see what's happening. For the sun sign, Taurus, remember you are the people who were born between the 12 a.m. and uh, 6 p.m. Okay. So for you sunrising people, we have the planet of Mars. That's a career change right there. A whole lot of you guys, and that's why I see a new beginning. I see the house, the building, changing of work, new works coming in. A lot of people are looking for ways to um, keep yourself going. I also see the energy of Mercury, which um, the universal angels and guides are going to be connecting with you you're an earth sign and I see the energy of the um, um, the Aries and these Aries people are going to help you to find your passion and this is going to be good for you fire people so you have fire and you have also the fire sign of the Aries coming in to help you guys and this is going to be special and wonderful okay as we look at the lunar people let's see what is happening for the moon people those are the people who were born between 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. and what do we have here what are we seeing for these lunar people we are seeing Neptune Neptune is the planet of the unseen that is your guides and angels and your spirit guides working with you I also see that the liberants are going to come in to balance whatever the scale of injustice is which we have the cross here the end of burdens and the end of troubled time and then we have the Tauruses so you yourself your own energy vibration people are going to be coming in your own type to help you so uh, um, the Taurus people are going to have more Tauruses connecting because some of you prefer to connect with the Virgos or the Capricorn people so um, more Tauruses are going to be coming in remember that the people who were who are Gemini are going to become Tauruses so these um, people these Gemini's are going to be coming over um, because they're going to be Taurus and you're going to go back to the fire sign so remember that a change is happening for you guys this is wonderful so ladies and gentlemen you need to understand that life and things are about to change and we need to go with the change and let's see what is happening um, I'm using the angels of abundancy to see what is coming out 
for you Tauruses in the month of October. We have pay yourself first. Make yourself your most important financial obligation by setting aside a portion of your income every time you are paid. This loving form of self-care ensure that you will have save to invest in your plans and the future so this is wonderful this is good and this is what this month is all about it's all about pay yourself first whatever it is you have the obligation to yourself okay so always save people always save because you never know what's in the rainy day and sometimes people think that oh you're you, you don't give away anything but you know sometimes you need to save because sometimes you need to build something around you so this is going to be one of the focus for you guys pay yourself first remember who you are this is going to be a positive month I want to say thank you for being here. Remember to listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign. And I am saying to all you guys, namaste to, until next time.